tearing up the rule book. The judges of this year's Booker Prize have chosen two joint winners, Canadian author Margaret Atwood for The Testaments and Anglo-Nigerian author Bernardine Evaristo for Girl, Woman, Other. At 79, Atwood becomes the prize's oldest winner, with a follow-up to her dystopian novel, The Handmaid's Tale. Atwood had previously won the Booker in 2000 for The Blind Assassin and becomes the fourth author to have won the prize twice. Uh, I would have thought that I would, be, would have been um, too elderly. Uh, <laughs> and I, I kind of don't need um, the attention. Um, <laughs> so I'm very glad that, that you're getting some. Thank you, thank you, thank you. In Girl, Woman, Other, Bernardine Evaristo's eighth novel, the author explores the lives of 12 characters, mostly black British women. Evaristo's win makes her the first black woman to win the Booker since it began in 1969. The fact that uh, a book by a, a black British woman writing about black British women, many black British women, um, the fact that I have won the prize with this, for, for won this prize with the book, I think is an incredible thing to happen because I don't think it would have happened probably five years ago or ten years ago. The Booker Prize for Fiction is awarded each year to the best original novel written in the English language and published in the United Kingdom. The two novels awarded this year beat four other titles to the win. For the first time since its creation, two authors will be sharing the award as well as the prize money of £50,000, one of the world's most lucrative literary prizes.